What if you could tap into a platform with millions of readers with one simple article to drive traffic to your website? You don't need an advertising budget and you don't need any SEO. Okay, so this is how to use Hacker Noon for traffic generation. I remember to like this video to tell YouTube to show you more content like this. But let's go to the computer. If we go to hackernoon.com, what you'll notice is a few options right here at the top. So log in, read or write. So we want to publish on this website. We want to be able to write stories, write articles and publish them. So in order to do that, click on this hamburger menu. You'll get this slide out menu where you can log in or sign up. If you don't have a free account, go ahead, sign up. You can log in with Google and Twitter and other services. So it makes it pretty quick and easy. Once you've signed up for your free account, the very first thing you need to do is click on your profile icon. You'll get this menu here, then go to settings. Here you can adjust your handle and you can change your display name to whatever you like. This is handy if you're building a brand or a personal brand and make sure that you upload your profile image, your avatar. Next, make sure that your short form bio is complete and then add a second biography if you want to fill in any more details. You can add your location if you're reporting from a specific location. And if you want people to see your total reading time, you can enable that here. You can also show your bookmarks and you can check this if you're representing a brand or a company. But perhaps one of the most interesting aspects of the profile section is under call to actions. So click on here and you will be able to add in a call to action and a link to your website. Not only that, we can also add in social links here and these will be displayed on your profile so people can click through and follow you on social. Okay, so now that we've got some basic housekeeping done, let's explore the website because I'm gonna give you a strategy that will enable you to get even more traffic. So what we want to avoid here is just publishing content without a clear strategy. I'll show you a strategy that will enable you to drive even more traffic with almost zero extra effort. So over here on the left hand side, we have this discover anything section. This is a search bar. So if you click on that, we'll have this slide out menu. We've got trending stories and good stuff like that. But I want you to type in something that is relevant to your niche, a keyword that is relevant to you. In this example, I'm going to type in something like SEO. So now we have stories, topics, people and companies. So we've got a few options on how we can use this data. For example, if you want to network and find people in your niche to connect with, then you would click on people. And now we know all the people who are interested in SEO or who publish SEO stories. This is relevant for a little strategy that I'm going to share later on. So bear that in mind. But for most of us, we'll want to go to topics and then we want to explore the tags here. So for example, if we take a look at SEO optimization, we can see that there's a 138 stories. And because there's so many stories here, the number of people subscribing to the tag is going to be healthy, but it's not going to be massive. So let's go back. Let's take a look at just SEO under topics, SEO. And here we have 533 stories. So it makes sense that the number of people subscribing to this tag is higher. So what you want to do is find the highest subscribed tags or the highest number of stories in your niche, because that is probably going to get you the most traffic. This is also going to tell you if there's a demand for your type of content on this website. Okay, so let's assume that we're happy with the tag that we've chosen. We know that our content is likely to get read. Click on the start writing button. It will take you to this page and you're going to have three options. So we can create collaborative content. We can start from scratch with a blank editor or we can import an existing story. Let me focus on this one just for a second because I think it could be very powerful for you. 
So here we can import a story, click on import story, and then you can paste a URL from your existing website, or if you've published elsewhere, perhaps on Medium or Blogger, you can pull that content directly into Hacker Noon. Let me show you. For example, if I want to pull in one of my articles about driving traffic from Reddit, I can paste in the URL here, then click import, and now it's pulling in all the content from that web page. Of course, I want to edit this a little bit. I may want to remove some of the branding and some of the navigation that's not really needed for this article. But as you can see, with a little bit of tidying up, it's ready to go. So that's going to make life easier for you. It's going to help you to repurpose your content to a wider audience. OK, let me show you another way to use this to drive traffic, because here, if we click on collaborative text editing, we can do something pretty powerful with this. We can invite other authors to collaborate with us on articles. So this is going to help you to get an even wider reach. It's going to help you to network in your space. And ultimately, it's going to help you to drive even more traffic because you can now cross promote or even run Q&A sessions with relevant authors in your space. So to do that, we need to, first of all, give this piece of content a strong title. So I'm just going to put in strong title here. Then we're going to add the categories. So let's say I'm working in SEO. I may want to add SEO. We can add in a few more tags as well. There we go. Then we can start writing our content or we can start adding co-authors. We can add up to three authors on that. That's a fantastic way to cross promote and to drive traffic to your links. I'll speak about linking to your content in a second. But if you know the the handle of the author you want to invite, you can add their handle here and then invite them to the article. But I would strongly encourage that you reach out to them beforehand, agree some kind of terms with them for this um, piece of content. Don't just wing it and hope people will accept your invitation. Do reach out beforehand and get to know them, network a little bit and build a relationship before inviting people to contribute to this piece of content with you. But let's say I have done that and I want to add this person here. I can just add them here and click invite and then they will be notified of that invitation and then they can contribute to the article. Let me show you another way to use this. So if we go back to writing, let me show you something cool. So here we can start from scratch with a blank draft. And again, we start with a strong title. So let's add that in here. But here we have this little plus icon. If you click on that, we can now add in things like to do lists, bullet lists, ordered lists. We can create tables, we can add quotes, we can put in dividers and page breaks. We can add images and links. I mentioned that I would speak about linking. So if we click on link, we can now paste in the URL of the site we want to link to. And then we have the option to make it an embeddable URL. I'm going to click yes for the moment. And there we go. So now it will pull in an embed straight into the web page. But let's say we want a typical, just a normal link. So I would highlight the text. We'll get this menu hover over the top of it. And now we can add a link by clicking this button and then pasting in the URL and hitting return. There we go. So when it comes to linking on Hacker Noon, don't go overboard. Maybe add one or two links per article and make sure that they're not overly promotional. Remember to respect the community here and to only link when it feels natural and you're linking to something of high value that will be of interest to the people reading the article. But if you are serious about traffic generation, then click the links in the description. The first link I have for you is to the underground traffic kit. This is an immense collection of secret traffic methods that you will not find anywhere else. Click the link to take a look below. Also, I will give you free access to a four day training series. This will show you how I drove over 30,000 website visitors every single day to a brand new website. And you'll see how one of my students has recently used it to generate over 700,000 hits in his first 12 days. Scroll down to the description area 
and check out those links now. Thank you for being here with me today and I will see you again very soon. Take care.